What's going on YouTube? This is Brent0331 and in this video we're going to be testing the effectiveness of the official Croatian military camouflage pattern commonly referred to as Cro-Pat. we we'll be testing the heavily vegetated woodland environment. Now I acquired this uniform from a company called Spartak. I'll post their information in a link below and we're also going to take a closer look, in-depth look at this uh, particular uniform here. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to leave a comment. All right, guys, so we're going to take a close-up of this uh, particular uniform. Again, this is the uniform that's offered by Spartak. I've posted their uh, website down below so you guys can go check them out. They are Croatian-based. Um, this is the official camouflage pattern of the Cro Croatian Armed Forces. And I want to point something out right here. If you look close, that OSRH, that's actually a little acronym for Armed Forces of the Republic of Croatia. Uh, the other thing that they have incorporated in their uniform is this. You look at these little brown areas right here this is actually an outline of the country of Croatia that they've incorporated into their utilities so kind of like how the Marine Corps um, on our camis we have the uh, Marine Corps emblem and underneath the Marine Corps emblem is USMC little tiny digitalized uh, imprints within our pattern that's incorporated into it um, they've got the same concept here so that's a neat little feature um, associated that's unique with this particular pattern um, so looking at the uh, the jacket so at the top the jacket has a Mandarin style collar, just like the uh, the Army ACU uniform. Um, in the center on the chest, you got two chest pockets. As you can see, they're slanted outward. So on the Marine Corps utility uniform, the uh, pockets actually oriented the opposite direction. So these are these are oriented outward instead of inward, like on uh, the, mil the U.S. military uh, utilities. On the sleeves, you got two sleeve. Uh, pockets on each side. These are closed by zipper So there's no flaps or velcro or anything like that. It's a zipper Zipper closure, but you do have the uh, velcro on the outside for you know any type of patches and whatnot um, Looks like you have You actually have two internal pockets on the chest here on each side. So you can see there Those are on both sides It's pretty pretty nifty there so you got two sleeve pockets, two chest pockets, and then two internal chest pockets. And then for the sleeves, sleeves are actually not buttons, they're Velcro. So you just tighten up via Velcro to the appropriate uh, size for your, uh, your wrist and whatnot. There's the back of the utilities. Here it's bellowed. And there's no, there's no any uh, like side adjustments on the uh, the blouse, like the old woodland style blouses at one point had those. But for the most part, it's very similar to the Army ACU cut, with a few additional enhancements. Going over the trousers, the trousers have a pretty unique feature here. If you look at the top, the top closure is two buttons, so you got the zipper. And then it closes with the two buttons. You have these big belt loops, which I like. It's kind of uh, reminds me of uh, the British style utilities. And then they also have these uh, Velcro straps here so that you can tighten up the pants without even using a belt. Uh, that's a good feature. You have two uh, thigh tight pockets on each side as well as the, the side cargo pockets. Now the side cargo pockets close with both. Sorry, I'm trying to do this one hand here. So your cargo side cargo pockets do, uh, they close with both Velcro and a zipper. And they're pretty deep, so it's pretty nice, uh, pretty nice cargo pockets. You got one of those on each side. Moving down the trousers, you've got the, uh, the slits on the knees for knee pads if you need to insert those or want to insert those you have that capability on both sides on a calf you've got these uh these lower calf pockets so you know if you want to keep some down there you got that option so there's plenty of pocket space plenty of features uh, for that turn them over Now, I do apologize, guys. I'm actually uh, filming this portion after I've already been in the woods. <laughs> As you can see, there's uh, there's mud all over these. So you got two ass pockets, 
Um, already covered the cargo pockets. Here's a pretty unique feature here. You got some uh, Velcro retaining straps. If you want to tighten these up around your uh, your leg and whatnot, that's a good feature. So you don't see that very often on uh, other utility trousers. Down here at the bottom, you get the same deal. You can tighten these up around your boots. You don't even need to wear boot bands or anything like that. Um, you just utilize these Velcro tabs to tighten up around your boot. So here's a uh, ball cap that was included with the package. It's your standard tactical style ball cap, um, but it's got Velcro on the front for you know a flag patch or whatnot, and then you also have a Velcro at the top for what could be an IR patch. The inside, not much to that, but uh. You can uh, tighten it around your head, adjust it to, you know, your head and whatnot, and one size fits all pretty much. So, that's it, guys. That's the uh, utilities offered by Spartac. Pretty good to go.
Well, that's it, YouTube. That includes this fakeness video over this Croatian camouflage pattern. If you like what you're seeing, don't forget to check out my channel and subscribe. I've already done several camouflage fakeness videos, and I plan on doing several more in the future. Also, don't forget to check out Spartax website that I posted in the information box below. They're the ones that donated this uniform to me and made this video possible. But thanks for watching, guys, and don't forget to leave a comment.